What is going on YouTube? This is Gavin21202, aka Gavin Orlandi, here bringing you all the latest WWE news, rumors, headlines, and updates. But in today's video, we are doing things here a little bit different. Uh, today will not be a, you know, a normal three-topic WWE news video like we normally do. Today will be a single-topic news video just to crunch it in. And with that being said, I do apologize for that. So uh, on Monday, you guys can expect the, f the full schedule to come back. Um... I'd say I've been doing pretty good lately, you know, every now and then get p putting out a short video in place of a long video. Not too often, I would say I do it, but um, with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, uh, I'm here today with a single news video. So next week, we'll be, we will be back to the original schedule of Monday, Wednesday, Friday for the long videos and then Tuesday, Thursday, a short video. So today will be a single topic news video. And ladies and gentlemen, I bring you guys breaking news in regards to the Olympic gold medalist. Kurt Angle. Now, for those of you that don't know, Kurt Angle is still very well under contract with the WWE. And now, with that being said, a lot of people are questioning, a lot of people are wondering what Kurt Angle's new role in WWE will be now that he's officially retired. And with that being said, it is confirmed that Kurt Angle is shadowing backstage WWE producers to learn the ropes. Now, with that being said, that would mean working in Gorilla, uh, or uh, with guys like Fit Finley, Joey Mercury, uh, and Jamie Noble, those types of guys. Uh, Matt Hardy, there were rumors that Matt Hardy was shadowing producers for quite some time, and that very well there could be some truth to that. But it is confirmed that Kurt Angle has been uh, shadowing producers, and that is expected to be his brand-new full-time role in the company. Um, and that's great for him, obviously. I mean, I think WWE could have done way more with his return, but it is what it is. They fucked it up. It's way too late to go back. You can't fix it now. So, um. In this case scenario, uh, it, I don't know, it, it's something where a lot of guys, you know, a guy like Ric Flair, you know, they retired in WWE, they went elsewhere and they continued their career. Uh, I personally, I don't think that's the way it should be done because I mean, you retire in one place. I think you're, you're retired. You're not just retired from WWE. You're not just retired from TNA. You're not just retired from Global Force or whatever the hell you're at. You're not retired from AEW. With that being said, um... Kurt Angle, yes, it does not seem like WWE will end up working him into a television role anytime soon, although it is very possible, uh, but Kurt Angle, retirement, WWE producer now, that seems like a pretty darn, that seems like a pretty darn good role, helping out the younger guys, uh, being on the side of, like, Hurricane Helms, who just actually became a producer, Shane Douglas, uh, excuse me, not Shane Douglas, the Hurricane, but anyways, ladies and gentlemen, I just want to let you know that today, single topic news video, the, the regular ones will be back on uh, Monday, and I do apologize. So, ladies and gentlemen, in order for me to bring you all the latest WWE news, rumors, headlines, and updates, I need you guys to like this video, favorite this video, share this on every social media platform that is humanly possible, and do me one last thing, and definitely subscribe. Thanks, guys. Love you all.